now the first thing you're going to look at is the width and then the height okay the width and then the height that's the dimension of the box by default a box is size such that it can hold its what its content within it so as the content increases the box is also what increasing now there could be a situation whereby you would like to you would like to set your own dimensions for the box you didn't want it to go by default you would like to give your own attribute to such boxes okay now you can do this thing by using um, pixels percentages or m's traditionally pixels have been the most popular method because they allow designers to accurately control their size now when percentages are used the size of the box is relative to the size of the browser and then if the box is what is encased within another box it is a percentage of the size of the containing box okay so the size of its mother box when you use amps the size of the box is based on the size of the test within it designers have recently started to use percentages and amps more for measurement as they try to create designs that are flexible across devices which have different size screens i'm going to show you an example after this slide we are going to see a container okay a containing element used which is what 300 pixels wide by 300 pixels high that means the width and the height are all 300 pixels inside of this is a paragraph that is 75 percent of the width and the height of the what containing element so you see the width 75 percent the height also 75 percent this means that the size of the paragraph is what is 255 uh, 225 pixels wide by 225 pixels high now this is the example i want to show you see a div what is the uh, the div here and then the div there and there's a paragraph within this div and it has these characteristics okay okay there's no class of a box here so this box can go off the height is 300 the width also 300 it has a background color this is like an ash whilst the paragraph is also the paragraph also has a height of 75 this paragraph is found within the box and a width of also 75 percent it also has a color okay it also has its own color so this is a paragraph found within the box let me show you using my test editor now in my test editor i've commented those uh, let me comment it out all right so this is the the css okay and this is the html which is uh, from the div area so this is let me get try and get the that is it here this portion this will be in a box with a particular color and then the paragraph within it has been given a width and height of 75 percent each okay so let me save this okay let me save this and then go to my css save the last work i did and then go straight into my browser okay so i can actually see it here this is the div so this is the biggest box and the biggest box is is 300 by 300 whilst the inner box which is the paragraph within the div is 75 percent with 75 percent height so this is by setting your own dimensions okay to read without going strictly to the default dimensions